We need to catch some bad guys, and it's up to you. Yes, sir. Can do. And right now we're on the scene. All right, we're going live. So right now we got a bunch of calls from a Russian man named Anton Romanov. Anton apparently, Romanov. apparently this whole place has been robbed multiple times. And so we've been getting calls and we decided we'd go check it out. Anton Romanov became famous after competing in and winning the popular game show World's Best Kitchen Chef, which penned the world's best chefs against each other in a rigorous cooking competition. All right. Yeah, yeah, that's his house right there. Mm -hmm. That's it. He lives in a nice house mm -hmm. for a Russian. Mm, that's true. He must be wealthy. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go check it out. All right, so right now we're at the house of Anton Romanov. Give him a little knock. Be quiet real quick. Be quiet. Just gotta play cool, okay? Thank you. Hello? Are you Anton Romanov? Yes. Sir, I'm gonna need you to step out for a second. Okay. So, we were told that um, something is going on here. Would you like to tell us about that? Yes, they've been robbed. You have been robbed. Mm -hmm. All right. Yes. Okay. 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 Tell us about it. Fearful of his privacy, so, Romanov okay. invited us inside. Shut up. Mr. Rolf is coming. Yes. 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 I got my hand now. Yes. Hello, sir. Pleasure to meet you, Anton. Yes. yes. All right. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna sit down, ask you a few questions. Okay. That's all. Oh. Now explain to us what happened here today. So three three a.m. I wake up to go poo poo, and there are men. There are three three men downstairs. Mm -hmm. They grab paraphernalia and yes. they're like. Hello, and then they run off. You know what I mean? Hello. Mm -hmm. So you keep saying that these people come back every day, is that right? Yes, they come back every single day. Mm -hmm. They come back every single day. Mm -hmm. Well, it looks like it's time for us to do a stakeout. I don't have no steak here. Yeah, we're coming in here, stealing my nuts, making holes, and yeah. stuff, Maybe digging, about. hopping the fences and stuff. You know what's hopping the fences, yeah. yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait a minute. See that? You see that? Oh, oh those no. squirrels? No, no, no. Shh, shh. They don't see us. It's them. Are you ready? <laughs> All right. You're going to ready. You ready, come man? You ready? All right, here we go. Wait, wait, wait. Another day successful. Yeah, you want to steal the Anton stuff? You want to steal the Rusty stuff? I think it's not. We're going to go better than Rusty. We're going to go somewhere better than Rusty. Get in there, Stum. Ah. All right. Let's go.
right now we're at our police department, and right now we're gonna go inside of our interrogation room to find out what's happening to that criminal we captured. Since our department was on a top budget, our interrogation room was actually a rearranged news studio. Hello? Is he ready? Oh, yeah. What is I brought the water. Good. Why? Let's go. Hell? The news studio even donated an extra camera to the department, which the inmate had been talking to for 45 minutes. Help me! 45 minutes. I've been waiting here. Starving, and I'm thirsty! Apparently at the prison, they don't water you, and they give you this shitty food on a prison plate. What is this? I'm living in hell! So, okay. All right, son, if you could state your name and age on that camera right there. I'm gay. Sir, that's not your name. That's not an age either. I want you to say your name and age on that camera right there. Can't. Say it! I don't feel comfortable. Do the water bottle thing. What? Have some water. Have some water. Go for it. Yes. Do you think that was for you? It's not anymore! Say your name and age! I don't feel comfortable saying my name. Okay, fine, alright. We'll get to the point. Who do you work for, and why did you rob the place? Who do you work for? Well, some could do this the easy way or the hard way, and I very much like the hard way. Easy way or the hard way? Which way do you want it? Okay, fine. Who do you work for? You work for? Who do you work for? Where is Who do you she? work for? Where is she? Is Stop! Who do you work for? Gaylord. Who? Micah Gaylord. Micah Gaylord. You got that on camera? Micah Gaylord. Okay. How much did he pay you? $1,000 per trip. Holy Please. shit! $1,000? That's more than I get in a gay for. I mean, I'm not gay. Why'd you do it? Well, why did he want you to go and rob the place? I don't know. You don't know. He just I, paid you and you did it. Yes. I mean, money's money. You finish him up. Ow. Please don't penetrate me. Oh, I will. Much. Go to the gay bar. You may go ahead. Tracking down Micah Gaylord was no easy task, so we had to put up some of our team's best to see if they could muster up any information on this criminal. Micah Gaylord was also a competitor in Master Hell's Kitchen's chef, but lost to Anton Romanov. Seeking revenge, Micah must have hired thugs to rob Anton. So that means he must have hired the other dude to rob him. Yeah, that's probably why he's there too. Uh, no, he's not important. What's okay. important is this guy. We need to find this man. Alright, let's load up the jeep. Can we kill him? Sure. Yeah! To get Micah Gaylord's attention, we set up a fake drug deal and got City Cop to go undercover. You in the act at one time, why don't you play the bad guy? It's Micah Gaylord been pointing. Micah! Micah Gaylord! Micah Gaylord! Micah Gaylord! Are you here to buy the marijuana? Um, no, no, um, no, I am here because I want to be bad guy. And I wanted, to, I wanted to know if you were hiring bad guys. And I want to collect bounties because, because I hate cops. So, would you like me to join bad guy crew? Are you a cop? Freeze! 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 As it turns out, Micah is actually deaf. Freeze! Get back! Good for you, boy. Now, come with me. Everything will be peaceful. No? No. Well, you 
are you doing? No! I'm okay. <laughs> Before his suicide, Micah Gaylord claimed he worked for someone else. But who could it be? The whole department spent days trying to find out who the mastermind was, until I stumbled upon something. Oh my god, it's him! Slam Jimbo. Another contestant of that game show, Chef Master Kitchen. He not only lost to Anton Romanoff, but he got his food stolen from him. It all makes sense now. He's the mastermind. He's getting back at Anton Romanoff by stealing from him. Well, Country Cop and I don't tolerate lawbreakers. To gear up for the special mission, the chief gave me an action camera and a new baton. Time to kick some ass. Um, you see here, he has a camera on his head so we can get a first person point of view. It's really hard for um, country cops to get this first person point of view, so it's going to be very, very difficult. I think we, um, think we have something. Did you see it? We're we'll try to sneak up on them. We're going to try our best. There is something. There is something. I got him, okay? Okay. Let me get the other one. You ready? Yeah. yeah. You ready? Let's do it. Trigger finger in the eye, put a little dirt on him. Put a little turf on him. Come back here. You are coming in bad. I've been real bad. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on. Get back. You can't put me next to Jewish boy. No. No. Oh god. You didn't do it. That's it. Hi, I found the bucket. I found the bucket. Hi. Put the hell on my bucket. Jesus Christ, there's a Jew in the back of the car. Hi. Well, that's going to do it for this episode of Buddy Cop. I'm your host, Country Cop. And I'm City Cop. We always get our coping, no matter what the cost. So there's no need. We're always safe out there. We're always safe out there. Mm, that's what <laughs> I just said. Yeah, see you next time. Okay. Uh, okay. I think we got it. I'll send these culprits back to jail. Yeah. Where are the culprits?
It's great. 